Hey everybody, I just wanted to go live in here, probably make this pretty short. Um, I've been busy the past few days, um, it's been really awesome, um, I mean I love being busy, I'm usually busy. <laughs> um, hey Patty, hey everybody, jumping on. Um, so I created this nurturing the creative universe, kind of just loose invitation for people to be playing during this Corona time. Um, and maybe we just call it like a creation time instead. <laughs> um, but you know, it's been really cool. There's been so many things kind of like coming together in my world around, the creation of living actually and just creating in a different way and I just wanted to you know this is not nothing earth shattering but just come on here and chat about it because um there's so many different things I like doing and I'm I'm really taking the space now to to do them like I've been busy and yet have felt very spacious as well like my days have felt very spacious. And I think part of it is just that the energy of the world right now is just different. And you could tap into the crazy, crazy and the fear and all that. And you can also tap into like the immense space of the earth. Um, and like the, the relief that the earth has with everything that is, um, like the slowdown of the world and, and, um, like the, yeah, just like the space. And for me, that's been more where my attention has been is just the space. Like I am loving the space of this time. And, um, and I, I'm baking. I, I used to be an amazing baker. Um, I actually started making, making pies from scratch, like pie crust and everything when I was about seven years old. I got really good at baking apple pies when I was a kid. <laughs> um, and I used to bake a lot. And I was even, I was vegan for a while. Um, about four years in my 20s, I was vegan. And um, I was a really epic vegan baker. Um, so that was cool. And um, so yeah, I've gotten out, I haven't, I'm, I've got, I just was able to get my hands on some flour today. So, <laughs> but I'm uh halfway, halfway through baking some biscuits and, um, have been, um, just like playing in the kitchen more and playing with my body more and creating, like creating two new websites right now. And, um, Hey Becky, Hey everybody. Um, creating my man is here now. So creating stuff with him. <laughs> um, and he's been creating a lot of cool stuff too. It's been really cool just to see like, just cause you know, when everything changes, which it has, it's just so, it's like, there's just such an opportunity to re redo, you know, like redo everything and, and look from a different point of view, look from a different space. And, um, and really like, it's like, what if like the falling apart, quote unquote, of the world, you know, wasn't actually a falling apart? What if it was like really this moment where we could come together and, and redefine creation, you know, and re, not even redefine it, but actually just like choose something different. And I did the Joy of Business um, facilitator training this week, which I was not going to do. I actually wasn't, didn't require it. I wasn't up for renewal or whatever. Um, and I, after the first day of the training, I jumped in late and, um, and it was, it was one of those where I just was like, oh my gosh, I need to do this. Like I, this class is just calling me and asking and, um, Hey everybody. Um, and so I jumped into the training and it just like exploded and exponentialized creation in my world. Um, and set so many things in motion and so many different energies and put up a bunch of new classes and, um, and just like really like it just added to the creative juice in my world right now, which is really fun. Um, and I love it how we can just, and, oh, I know what I was going to say is we were talking about how, 
um, Simone Melissus, who's the the creator of Joy of Business, she was saying, you know, you've like you've got to be able to like if your business isn't if you aren't willing and your business isn't such that you can change everything on a dime, um, you're not really like it's it's like that's what these this time is actually asking for and calling for is that we we be able to change anything on a dime at a moment's notice and not be attached to stuff, not be fixed on things, but be prepared to continually evolve. And um, that's one of the things about creation that I'm, I'm so digging lately is just like the continual evolution of like, oh, now this changed and now this changed and now this is changing and now this is changing and like classes that I've put up where we're like moving the dates or changing the format or whatever. And really staying with the energy of creation in the energy of creation and not in any sort of fixed structure, but just cool. Now what, now what, now what, you know, what can we add, tweak, change, create? Um, and that's been so fun and just like surrounding myself at home with, you know, all the creative things that I love to play with. And I haven't, haven't done any painting yet. That's been on my, on my docket, but, um, I need to, I would like to get out some of my paints soon and do that. Um, but first, I got to make some biscuits and some cookies and some parsnip puree. I'm making parsnip puree. Brian is an epic steak cooker. He is like a brilliant, he's actually a brilliant chef. And um, he makes really good steak. And I make really bad steak, but I really love eating steak. And so when I want steak, I go out, except for right now. You can't do that. Takeout steak is a little weird, you know, not so good. You kind of want to have it like hot off the press, you know. So anyway, he's making steak. I'm going to make parsnip puree because I love parsnip puree. Um, but, so I'm making white things in my kitchen. <laughs> um, but just like constantly... Like what, so if you're, if you're, and so I'm kind of all over the place here, but if you're not like, what could you be adding? What could you be choosing? What could you be adding to what it is that you're doing right now? And it may just be something that you just love, you know, something that you just really enjoy that you haven't done in a long time. Maybe it's even just like d putting on music and dancing to one song, you know, or, or doing something different with your body that you've never done before, or making a different food, or making a different drink, or something like that. Just doing something different, or playing with something different in your business. Like, mix it up. You know, what can you change? What can you add? What can you tweak? Um, and um, what can you create that is actually going to really um, expand your world? And what's so cool is when we add things like that, it's kind of like me just jumping into the training I wasn't, I was like, oh, maybe I should just not spend the money right now. But it was like, this isn't about that. It's about the choice for creation. And the way that that training just exploded my whole world, my whole creative world and my whole business was just amazing and so not linear and so not predictable. Um, and it was like, as soon as I signed up for it and started listening to it, I was like, just like off to the races with creation. And that it's just, I just enjoy that, you know, it's, it, it, like, I'm not getting down on, you know, what's going on in the world right now, because I'm just enjoying creating so much, um, so what's available, what's possible and available to all of us, if we just choose to create and choose to add things to our lives that, you know, might not make any sense, might not make any sense right now, but it's like, no, I know I need to add that. I know I need to do that. I know I need to choose that. Or I just desire to. And because if you're not creating, you're kind of shrinking and dying. You know, like your life will shrivel when you're not creating. Um, and the more I create, the more that's true for me. So what can you be adding to your life today? And I haven't, you know, it was my plan was when, with this nurturing the creative universe thing. My plan was, okay, I'm going to. I'm going to be posting stuff every day and, um, I've been so busy. <laughs> I, haven't, I haven't, I've missed a few days. So I just wanted to come and say hi to everybody in this group and, um, invite you to, to turn it on and turn it up and step it up and play and, and just know that like even something as simple as like baking cookies or making something different in your kitchen or doing 
five minutes of movement with your body, like even something as simple as that can add this energy to your whole life that just infuses everything. And it can change your money flows and it can change your body and it can change so many things. Like we think so often that we have to do one, make one huge change to create a big change. But what if it's just the addition of all these things all day long that nurture us and feed us and that are fun for us that creates this like landscape and this sort of tapestry of joy and the joy of creation. So that's my invitation to you. Let's keep playing with this whole creative universe thing. Um, I have got, I've got a lot of stuff coming up next week. I've got, we're going to, I don't think we've even posted, we, I know we haven't posted it yet, but I'm doing a, an online business systems class. So anybody who is looking for, you know, like more ease with online business. Um, I'm going to do a class on that next week. I'm doing another cocktail class. Um, that's on Thursday next week. And, um, and I have a business and different class coming up on Friday, Saturday, Sunday, the 10th through the 12th of April, um, in like U S time. Um, and then another one at the end or beginning of May in, um, Russia, Europe and Russia time. But that class is, a, it is, I always say it's like a creation master class and really gets you into um, the joy of like just creating for the sake of creation, for the sake of creation, for the sake of creation. Because creation begets creation, begets creation, and then money follows and, and all of that. Um, so if you want to deep dive into that, that class is happening um, a week from today, I guess it is. Um, that was a pop-up. That was a pop-up class. Um, lots of fun stuff coming up, and we'll be playing here in the Creation of Living group too. So let's play. Let's have more fun than we're supposed to right now. Um, let's nurture that creative universe called you. And what can you add to your life, living, reality, day, in this moment right now? Like when you get off of this Facebook Live, what can you do? What can you create? What can you add? If creation was not significant, but it was just the joy of being alive and the joy of playing, what could you do that would really nurture you? Um, and whatever you do, don't have any fun with that. <laughs> Thanks, everybody, and have a good one. Bye.